Swinburne University of Technology. As an engineering student, there are tons of different opportunities for you to get help. There's for engineers, there's mentors, there's rovering, there's the MASH Centre, and there's a number of different volunteering opportunities around the university. For first year students who are struggling, there are a lot of support services available which the other bigger universities don't actually offer. There's many different people that you can go see and they're all willing to help and put aside time. Connect Study Group's a great initiative where we uh, try and facilitate uh, first year students helping each other out and working through problems as a team. As a Connect Group leader, the most enjoyable part was seeing students learning from each other. It gets them sort of communicating better and understanding that uni life and corporate life outside of uni, I guess, is easier if you work with people. Um, you don't have to do it all on your own. And some of these bonds can become really strong later on in the stage and these students might see each other graduating together. It also helps in making lifelong friendships. The French Engineering Mentor Program is a program where uh, beginning students get assigned a mentor just to help them and guide them. So we're not mentor in the sense that uh, you've got an official person in a position of power that's looking after you. No, what we want to try and do is match a student with another student, so someone who's been through what I went through one or two years prior. I think a mentor is a nice role model for the mentees and just uh, someone with a bit of experience who's been in their position and been in their shoes. Mentors are great just to point you in the right direction and give you that bit of helping advice that you need. So engineering Rovers are students who are competent enough to teach other students who need help. At the front of the engineering building, we sit there and we're free for any student to come up and speak to us about any academic help or just general information they need about campus. If a student comes to us or groups of students come to us, they ask us questions and we work through it step by step. Women in Engineering is a new group in Swinburne. It's been put together by the faculty to help support the females in the course. It's very supportive, it's like-minded and it just creates a really good forum for different discussions. Obviously we're a little outnumbered in the course but we put it together to help with the social aspect and also just to get the message across that it doesn't make a difference that there's not as many of us. The MASH Centre helps you with maths and statistics. It's excellent for providing extra maths help. It's the same tutors who teach them in their lectures and their tutorials but they are happy to give extra support by the MASH Centre. That you can go to any time and there will be someone there willing to help you. Volunteering for me is a way to be able to showcase my passion and talent in engineering and to persuade those young minds, which I think are so brilliant, to be able to take on a role which is vital in our community. So we're going to attend a lot of expos where we get to uh, interact with kids at a high school age. These volunteer days at these high schools gives us a chance to, to let the wider community know what our goals and visions are. And sort of inspire kids to pursue a career in engineering. I love volunteering because of all the different friends I've made. It's not just a place to learn things, it's also a place to meet people, make friends. So the Swinburne Faculty of Engineering is a very community-based feel. It's very supportive. All the lecturers are really there for you. All the disciplines really interact well with each other. And it's a nice tight-knit community where everyone sort of is involved in different things, but we all really get along and work together for lots of common goals. As a mentor, I've just loved helping people. Uh, I know that if I had the opportunity to be a mentee in one of these programs, that would have helped me immensely. If you do ask for help, there is help there. I got involved in the mentoring program because I thought that it was a, a great idea and something that I would have really liked as a first year student myself. Um, so I sort of wanted to pass that down to the, the next group of students who are coming through. I've actually made the transition from a mentee to a mentor and basically I saw it as such good help to myself, I wanted to be able to give back. It's really rewarding in regards of skills that you can take out into the workforce after you graduate as well. Lots of communication skills, lots of leadership skills that employers are always looking for and at the end of the day it's also just fun. It's really important that you just enjoy your time at Swinburne and there are lots of areas there which can support you. This has been a Swinburne production. Thank <laughs> you.